How was your ride? Your face is red. Why is your face so red? Is that from life? You're gonna go have your pump refilled. Your belly pump. How you feeling? Why are you so red? What are you doing with that? Let go of that, you fresh. That's not for you. That is not for you. That's for the doctor. <laughs> are you looking for trouble? I was just waiting to see if a prescription was available. You I did awesome. Already. Uh, yeah. Well, that's a happy face. He's happy. He did great. You did so great. Ready for the long ride back? Huh? Long ride back? You ready? I'm gonna go open the car. Let's go. Oh no, I'm stuck in the door. I do. I need a new van. Smaller one. How would you get in the floor? You think he just got refilled? They put 20 mLs in there, you know. And uh, he doesn't go back now until Hi. Uh, April or something. Are you playing this thing? You playing it like a boss? Because you want to know why he always spoke to me in micrograms. So today I was like, well, how much are you actually putting in the pump? And he said 20 ml. When he breaks it down into micrograms per hour and stuff, it makes no sense because he gets different micrograms at different times of the day. He gets more at 7.15, 2 o'clock, and 8 p.m. And then th that's when he gets little, like, surges. Oh, yeah. And then any other part of the day, he gets less than that. He gets less than the surges, which I don't know how, I don't know how it pumps it, you know, how many micrograms per hour, you know. Because, because it's two pounds. Yeah. I like that. Is that bumpy? Good stuff. Bumpy bumps. Um, you push it to me? Good. Push it. There is a, a chunk that decided to get out of school. They just said because of the timing, you know. I was like, so. Oh, pull over. Uh, perfect time. Up to date. This is a vibrating pillow. I'll talk to you later. This one vibrates. You have to push on it. You know what? I'm talking on the phone. I didn't even realize you were on me. You don't like the vibrating? Okay. You find something else? You want a Henry? Mm, he doesn't want Henry. You alright? We can roll this, make it flat, and then push it. Push it. Push the, the blah. Play with the sand. Feel, feels really cool on your hands. Watch. Oh, isn't that nice? I think it's therapeutic for me. Isn't it? Oh yeah, it's very stress relieving. I forget which one, but one therapy office I went to had this stuff out. And they had this... Did you ever see those little gardens with the rakes and the stones and stuff? Yeah. That's what they did with it, right? For anxiety, yeah. Because yeah. Jamie got that for Christmas from, like, work. Same kind of sand and then set up like that. Like the little rake and a... A Zen garden, is that what they call it? Something like that, yeah. Now what are you going to do? You're buried. Oh! Oh, boy.
Yeah, you're gonna get this in your sleeves. The stuff is easy though to clean up. It doesn't really. But you know what's funny about it? If you try to pick up that little piece, it like melts. You can't get it off. You can't, it's impossible. You have to like do yeah. this. But yeah, it doesn't like make a mess in your hands or. Does that feel good on your fingers? Imagine if this was real beach sand and that's how every beach was. Yeah. That'd be awesome. You should make a beach with just this thing. Delia and I are having an awesome sand session right now. Doesn't that feel nice? It's kind of addicting. It is. That's what I was saying. You just keep squishing it. You keep wanting to play with it. How about we do our fingers really open? Can you do open? Good. Now this one. Stretch them and squish it. Like that. Pretend your hand's a starfish. Something nice. And meanwhile, we're standing and weight bearing nicely on our Fiji's. Do you think I need to pick Thomas up today, huh? Howdy! I hear my husband's home. I'm cold. I'm sitting here sniffling because I'm so chilly. I got the heater on. I'm like working on my computer. Oh, I need more light. It got dark. John is home. It's snowing out. Surprise. Snow. Actually pretty heavy. I picked Thomas up and uh, got back just as we were getting back. It started snowing. So we were supposed to have a concert tonight and they canceled it again for the second time. It's uh, it's a gala opening for our new high school auditorium, whatever, and they've been constructing it, I guess, redoing it for a year and a half, so, just, anyway, I'm looking out the window at the snow, look at that. Winter. Hi, Daddy. Daddy's home. I know. You guys are sink broke. We need a new sink thing. We need a new faucet. It like went boop. Okay. I'm gonna buy one, but I gotta look around. I can't have the plumber put it in because I hurt myself trying to fix it. I don't bend over backwards very easily underneath a sink. I am now going out into the outside. <laughs> look. It's still snowy out there. Come on. Come on, dogs. But it's a little bit warmer now. It's like 20. Come on, honey. Ah. Okay, we are outside. I lit my angel. I'm going to have to put it away pretty soon, but I still like it, especially when it's snowing. It looks pretty. And 
I don't have a flashlight. Um, I need to look at, hold on you guys. I think I left my phone in the car. So let me get it. Hurry up. It's a little warmer out. I didn't put coats on. Well, hopefully this is a fast trip, guys. Let's go. I want to go to bed. I'm tired. Good night, friends. Good night, friend. Good night, friend. Sweet baby. Good night, honey. Husband.